it, I don't think that the point is not that the, whether a specific rule or regulation was broken, but it's a kind of a, it's a public trust issue that was broken, you know, a credibility that was broken issue here. Um, you know, it didn't have to be about this. It could have been about anything. You know, it could have been about aid to Borneo. It's not that I know that a lot of people <coughs> are saying that it's more important perhaps because it was about the Iran negotiations, but in fact any deletion or editing of any part of a briefing on any subject should be wrong and not acceptable. So a couple Isn't of points correct? on that. A couple of points on that. First of all, um, you know, and we've said this uh, from day one uh, when this uh, allegations or this incident first came to light. Um, one product, a video, was edited. We've acknowledged that, and we've made steps to correct the policy going forward so that that never happens again. But there was always a transcript available of that briefing, and there was always uh, a video available of the full briefing on divots. Uh, so uh, I understand, and I understand, and I appreciate the tough questions that you all are asking us in the in this room, uh, and we are uh, doing our best to answer. But there's a lot of overblown rhetoric beyond this room about what happened and what transpired. Uh, we believe we have uh, conducted uh, an inquiry into what happened. We don't have the answers, uh, ultimately, why this was done or why this was requested. Uh, and so, uh, like many of you, we're asking ourselves the same questions, but we don't have any further leads uh, to investigate. Uh, so uh, we're at, a, as I said yesterday, a, a bit of a dead end. Uh, but uh, we're going to continue to, uh, as we get information, more information, we'll pursue that. But what's important here is that we take steps so it doesn't happen in the future. Matt, or, 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 sorry. 